What you eat today is affecting the health of your kids and even your grandkids. If you want healthy little versions of you running around one day, it's important to know this. You know the saying, you are what you eat? Well, it's not entirely true because you are actually what your mother, father, and grandparents ate too. In the last two decades, we've discovered that the nutrition you received while you were developing is what determines the likelihood of developing diseases when you're older. See, the egg that made you was once in your mother, and the egg that made her was once on her mother, your grandmother. And the way that you received nutrients while you were developing was telling your body how to turn on or off genes. If there wasn't enough nutrients to grow well, what will happen is that some of the genes that should have been turned on and operating will be turned down. Imagine it like a dimmer switch on a light. This dimmer switch is a mechanism that we call epigenetics. Later in life, the more genes that were turned down, the more vulnerable a person will be to having disease. Now, this doesn't go to blame mothers for all the diseases we have today. Fathers play a role too, and a number of diseases are attributed to our lifestyles. However, when a fetus is developing inside a mother is when the cells are most prone to epigenetic changes. So, when you're looking after your nutrition, you're also looking after your offspring. And alternatively, when you're neglecting your nutrition, I hate to say it, but you're also neglecting your offspring, especially during pregnancy. And this is why.